Hello. This quick little example here, I'm going to show you how you can use Apple Notes to quickly go through a paper and actually access all the code and be able to work through this systematically. So I'm at this section in this paper here where I'm looking at an algorithm. It's more efficient to use Apple Notes for this sort of thing because all I have to do is just click here. This opens up GitHub. Now I have the code. I can click on this. I can copy the repository here. I can even use the GitHub CLI. But what I'll do is I'll actually go ahead and copy this. And then I'll open up Visual Studio Code. The next step here is you want to clone down the repository. Okay, so here I am in Visual Studio Code. Now I'll run git clone. And I'm cloning down the repository from this paper. The next step is to go through and reproduce the results from the other researchers. Now we have the readme. So we ran git clone and pulled down the repository. The next step is to download the modules, modules tar.dz, and then we need to run the install script and then work through these bash lines here. Each one of these specific lines is an instruction for how to reproduce what these researchers were able to achieve. As we work through these, eventually we'll get to the point where we have a working version of their code. And if we don't, it's a matter of just simply reaching out to them and then continuing to keep working through this line by line until we get to the final part here, which actually shows what they're able to achieve. So at the end of this, we have a training model from scratch and we have an expected time usage of 21 hours. So this can, this can take a little bit to run. And then here's an actual error that you know has popped up before. And so if we run into this issue, just making a mention of that will be helpful.